Hello friends, it's me. Today we are watching a bootleg Darman video from a channel called Generation Hope. I'm trying to find the hope. About an evil foster care mother. Let's see what kind of shenanigans they get up to. Douglas? What are you doing here? Run. What? I, I can't hear you. Got you dumb kid. Time for payback. Go! <laughs> Kid, what are you doing there? She just nabbed the child. What are you doing just standing there? Got you, you dumb kid. Bigger than you, I'm faster than you, I'm stronger than you. Now you stay here while I see how much money I can sell you for. There are a lot of people out there that would be interested in a girl like you. What? You're going to sell your child? You sicko. That's illegal. You can't do that. 911, what's your emergency? Uh, hello? Please help. Who still got one of these phones from 1992? No! Please stop! You know, you could have just unplugged the phone, but hitting it with a baseball bat works too. You really thought you could outsmart me? What did you tell them? You didn't tell them anything. Yeah, right, like I'm gonna believe you. You know what? It doesn't even matter. By the time anyone comes looking for you down here, you're gonna be long gone. <gasps> Girl, you could have been like, I gave them your name, address, and social security number. They are coming for you now. Then what? Are you really trying to like, connect the phone back together? We're sorry, the number you have. We're sorry, nope. the number you have. Not working. We're sorry, the number you have. You know, it's 911, right? If you're getting that error message, that means the phone is working. Please come pick up. Pick up your phone, idiot! Child in distress is calling. How does she even know any numbers? You know, you have a working phone. The ability to call somebody, the call went through. Why don't you call the police instead of this random dude? Hello? Uh, I've been kidnapped. Can you please call the cop? Ashley, is this you? No. My name is Olivia. I've been kidnapped. Please call the cops. Olivia? <gasps> I don't remember dating Olivia. My name is Olivia Rodriguez. Wait a second, Olivia Rodriguez? She's famous! Is this what happened before she was famous? This is her origin story? I am 14 years old and I live in 3647 Lexington Avenue in West Hollywood. I've been kidnapped and I really need you to call the cops. Please help. Not much time until I'm gone for good. Oh, I get it. <laughs> Listen, I'm I'm really sorry to call you back, but uh, this is no way to get me to go on a second date. I respect the originality, though. What a freak! Why would you think she's asking to go on a second date? Are you insane? Like she literally gave you her address, said she needs help. Just to let you know, you've been sold for two point three million dollars <laughs> to a tycoon in Africa. What? So you just posted a Craigslist ad selling a child to the highest bidder. And what, they gonna pick her up and take her to Africa? What is an oil tycoon doing buying kids? Hmm. So why would you tell her? Now she's gonna be like, ooh, I'm expensive. Get an ego and just get up and leave. Oh, that's the look I was hoping to see. Seeing you like this is almost better than the money. Well, goodbye now. I'll be back later to get you so I can deliver you to them. Oh, so he stayed on the call? Weirdo. Hello? Are you still there? Yeah, yeah. I, I, I believe you. I, listen, I'm, I'm gonna call the cops right now, okay? Wait, wait. Don't hang up. Now you believe her? You hear a strange voice. I sold you for 2.3 million. I would have grabbed some popcorn and started eating it like, oh, this is getting interesting. These spam callers have stepped up their game. So when do you take my credit card information? The phone I'm calling you from is broken. And if you hang up, I don't think I'll be able to call anyone else. Can you go to my house and check if my mom's okay? If you're in the business of selling kids, why would you leave them with a phone in their room? This whole thing is just nuts. Doesn't make any sense at all. I'm gonna drive to your house and let your mom know that you've been kidnapped. Where do you live? <laughs> 36. Wow, so this random freak like is gonna Avenue be the hero. In West Hollywood. Damn, I'm all the way in Santa Monica. I'm like an hour away. Can you hold on that long? I don't know. I'll try. Can't you idiots like call the police? Let them do their job? Instead we got this wannabe vigilante like, oh, I'm a saver myself. Don't worry, we're gonna get you out of there, okay? Okay, thank you so much. Okay, hold on. What was 
is your name? Liam. Nice to meet you, Liam. I said the same, but it's kind of a weird way to meet someone. Okay, let's call the cops. You don't say! Call the cops and give them this information! Why do you call this random dude? Hey! Hey, there's an emergency! You need to call the cops! What? I'm talking to this girl on the phone, she's been kidnapped. Why didn't you call the cops? Because I'm talking to the girl that's been kidnapped. What? Well, why doesn't she call the cops? Because her phone's broken. Then how is she talking to you right now? <laughs> Look, it's a long story. Can I just please use your phone to call the cops? This is the only reasonable, realistic person in this show. It's not a joke, okay? Please. Sure fine, fine, like just don't joke. be checking my dating apps. Why would I do that? Just promise you're not going to be checking my dating apps. Okay, okay, I'm not going to check your dating apps. You could have dialed 911 for him. Put it on Phone. This is pissing me off. Hello, hi, yeah. Stupid. Uh, this is this Liam is. Smith. Um, I'm over here on DeLong Prix in Ogden. Uh, there's a girl that's been kidnapped. She just called me on my yeah. cell phone. Um, her name's Olivia. She's at 3647 Lexington Avenue. Yeah, I'm on my way there right now. Okay. Okay, thank you. Alright, thank you. Did you check my dating apps? Yeah, actually, I didn't see any text backs. Hello, ma'am. I'm Officer Sanchez. Finally, we got a, a call that your daughter's missing. Yeah. Yeah, she is. So why didn't you call the cops and tell them your daughter was missing? We got a whole entire mother here. What are you gonna do? Sit in a corner and cry about it? Should have called them hours ago. I thought you guys couldn't send anybody until after 24 hours had passed. What? Yeah, my daughter is missing. Man, we're gonna have to wait at least 24 hours to make sure she's actually missing before we waste any time. In what world? Los Santos got better cops than this. Looks like today is a lucky day because they sent me to look into it. Someone from up above must be watching over your family. Oh my God. Yeah, that's great news. Well, can I come in? <laughs> You know, to look for any clues that may help us know why your daughter got kidnapped. Bro was clueless. Like, can I come in? Shouldn't you be like looking for my daughter who got kidnapped? Kidnapped? My baby's been kidnapped? Oh, sorry about oh, that. Oh, she don't even know that. I, I meant missing. I'm working on so many cases. I just, I get them mixed up sometimes. <laughs> Know nothing about this case. Oh man, I'm just so busy all the time. Don't care about you or your daughter, actually. I can write a better script, play better actors than these people. What can you tell me about your daughter? Any clues that may help us know where she is? Any friends she likes to hang out with? Any boyfriend she wants to run away with? Anyone that may want to hurt her? Well, she just started a new school again, so she doesn't really have any close friends. Uh, definitely not a boyfriend. You know, if she had a boyfriend, you wouldn't know about it. That's facts. As far as anybody that would hurt her, um, the only person I can think of is um, her foster mother. Her foster mother? Yes. A few months ago, we were going through some hard times and I had to put her into foster care. Wait a second, that's her real mom. Did you like go to jail and then the kid is just like temporarily in foster care? But. The person that was supposed to be taking care of her was just using her for a paycheck from what I've learned from movies A lot of people use foster care to just make money. Yeah, I'll watch all these little turds I mean kids for a check and what is this evil foster mother's name? She goes by Miss Johnson But, um, but her real name is Catherine Catherine Johnson <gasps> The Catherine Johnson dun 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 Ma'am, we are in LA County. How many Katherine Johnsons we got? Katherine Johnson. Okay, I'll be sure to send this information back to the station. Also, do you mind if I use your restroom? Of course not. What do you mean, bro? No, you cannot use my restroom. You should be out finding my daughter. I don't let strangers use my bathroom. Uh-uh. Hey, Kate, I'm here. Listen, she knows you're in on it. <gasps> it's a fake cop! No wonder he was so okay. stupid. That'll be an extra 20,000. <gasps> Got it. Hello? 
Hello, is this Amy Rodriguez? Yes, yes, this is her. We just received a call from an LA resident named Liam Smith saying that your daughter was kidnapped. We just wanted to confirm that this is true. What do you mean? You know, before we check that the kid is actually kidnapped, let, let me call her mom and make sure. My daughter has been kidnapped? Well, according to the information we received, that seems to be the case. When was the last time you saw your daughter? Wait, I, I don't understand. What don't you understand, Mrs. Rodriguez? You already have an officer here that's taking care of her case. <laughs> That's the first red flag. Bro just has cop on his party city jacket. Criminal of police. Mrs. Rodriguez, Messing with the wrong person today. Are over to your residence. Wait, what? <gasps> what? Thank you for watching this video. Bro just looped her out. And then we got the kid who was kidnapped saying thank you for watching this video. What are you doing? you were kidnapped kidnapped and forced to make these horrible videos i'm so sorry that was one of the worst things i've ever watched but anyways that's all for today i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did make sure to hit that like button in the face and subscribe join the wolf pack and make sure you turn on notifications click click and i just released some new merch we got hoodies shirts tank tops at ogwolfpack.com i'll link it below oh i love you guys so much thanks for watching bye guys